Good evening. Welcome to BBC One Sport Report. In a game that has made me enjoy my reassignment because of my alcoholism, the New York Giants put a terrific scare into the Dallas Cowboys, but fell 22 points to 21 in the wild card round at Dallas. The first half saw a massive defensive struggle. It was nil-nil, then New York scored a touchdown to start the scoring. Dallas responded, Danny White hit Tony Hill for a 48-yard gain with a few seconds to go. With no timeouts, Dallas kicked a field goal to pull within 7-3. to three. In the absolute turning point of the game, with 8 minutes and 37 seconds left in the third quarter, on a third and 19 from the Giants' 34-yard line, Danny White hit Cosby for a 20-yard gain and a first down, keeping the drive alive. Tony Dorsett then scored a short touchdown and Dallas had the lead 9 points to 7. In the fourth quarter, Dallas had a 15-play, 80-yard, 8-minute and 8-second drive that resulted in a White to Cosby touchdown to make it 15 points to 7. Again, Butterfingers the holder fumbled the snap for his second time. New York scored to make it 15 points to 14 as they closed the gap to 1. College football has two-point conversions, but the NFL does not here in 1982. Then the absolute devastating play of the game happened. Down 15 points to 14, Dallas punted. New York had a second and nine on their own 30. Woolfolk ran up the middle for five yards. He continued running but forgot the ball. Dallas recovered the ball and Woolfolk was devastated. Dallas then scored and hit the extra point. Although New York scored again, the game ended 22 points to 21. An absolutely devastated Woolfolk sat in his locker sobbing uncontrollably. I let everyone down. Six months of work down the drain because I fumbled. We had them. Fooge. Coming up on BBC Two, a backstabbing reporter takes a better story than this and reports upon the future of Coventry City. Then on BBC Three, a new episode of Are You Being Served as Mr. Rumbold gets shot by the police after urinating in public.